When a child is born prematurely, the, the problem with those small children is that the lungs are the last organ to develop. So when they are born, their lungs are immature and it's hard for the lungs to be filled with air and oxygen, which is, of course, vital for life. But currently, there's no method that is non-invasive and not dangerous at all for the kids um, to be able to detect how much oxygen is present in the different parts of the lungs and how much air is present in the different parts of the lungs. We're working with a technique um, that makes it possible to detect uh, the amount of oxygen and the amount of air present in the lungs of small newborn infants. We use laser light um, at different wavelengths and uh, each of those wavelengths can probe different gases uh, through these spectral fingerprints that each gas has. What we have done is that we've made studies on uh, newborn full-term infants that weigh maybe three and a half, four kilos. Um, we, we did a study with 29 small uh, newborn babies where we measured and were able to detect oxygen signals on them. Uh, but the technique needs more development to be able to determine the exact concentration of oxygen. And that is where we stand now, to take the next step to be able to measure on these fragile, small, very small, premature infants.